Facebook removes two networks from the Philippines and China for violating its policies on coordinated inauthentic behavior. In a blog post on Tuesday, September 22, Facebook's head of security policy, Nathaniel Glacier, says the removal was due to the behavior of the networks and not the content of the posts made. Facebook says the removed Philippine network had links to the Philippine military or police. The military and police issue separate statements denying any link to the accounts. The Philippine network was made up of 57 Facebook accounts, 31 pages, and 20 Instagram accounts with coordinated inauthentic behavior focused on a Philippine audience. The Filipino network was posted in English and Filipino about local news and events including domestic politics, military activities against terrorism, the anti-terrorism bill, criticisms of communism, youth activists and the opposition, the Communist Party of the Philippines, and its military wing, the New People's Army. Meanwhile, the Chinese network's activity focused primarily on the Philippines and Southeast Asia more broadly, and also on the United States. Facebook added to the clusters of connected activity used fake accounts to pose as locals in the countries they targeted. The network liked and commented on other people's posts about naval activity in the South China Sea, including U.S. Navy ships. This campaign tried to hide its identity and location using virtual private networks or VPNs. It discussed a number of topics, including Beijing's interests in the South China Sea, Hong Kong, support for President Rodrigo Duterte and Sara Duterte's potential run in the 2022 presidential election, criticism of news website Rappler, and issues relevant to the overseas Filipino workers. Facebook's investigation added that it found links to individuals in the Fujian province of China.